So the instrument bef that you have before you is a five octave marimba. And it's a little unusual in the percussion world that in the Western percussion world that people aren't as familiar with this instrument. The bars or keys are made out of Honduran rosewood, which is a very dense hardwood. And then it also has resonators, which are these gold things underneath, uh, that are made out of aluminum or brass. And they serve to amplify the sound on this instrument. Uh, normally percussionists use different mallets to get different sounds on this instrument. Um, for instance, this is a soft mallet, it sounds like this. Here's a medium mallet. And here's a hard mallet. So you can obviously hear the timbre differences. Uh, the keys themselves are arranged like a piano uh, with lowered bars and raised bars. A piano has 88 keys total and seven octaves, or seven octaves and a third. A marimba, this is a five octave instrument, it has 61 keys and five total octaves. So the piece you're gonna hear I composed uh, about, or I completed about three years ago is called In Flux. And it was written ultimately to utilize the entire range of this instrument. And one of the characteristics of this composition are that it has frequently shifting musical ideas. And a lot of these ideas were inspired by kind of the gamut, emotions, gamut of emotions I was experiencing starting in about 2009 when I was completing my doctorate at the University of North Texas and while simultaneously getting the job here at Utah State. Uh, and those emotions including the excitement and angst of moving to a new city uh, that was really far away, the pressures and, of, and excitement of getting a new job and the tenure process, recruiting new students, and kind of the awe and majesty I felt when I looked at the scenery and landscape in Logan Canyon and around the West. And let's just say I did not have those same feelings of majesty and awe in North Texas, not the prettiest of places. <laughs> Hope I didn't offend anyone from Texas. So I, I didn't start out initially to write a piece for this instrument. I would have ideas, musical ideas in my head and I would take note of them and transcribe them on a piano. And eventually I, I started realizing that some of these ideas would work well on the marimba. And so I combined all these ideas into this piece in flux and, and listened for all these shifting musical ideas that kind of uh, represented my emotional state over the past few years. So I hope you enjoy Influx for a solo marimba.